All right, first pie guy here. You're looking at the discone scanner antenna made by Tram. Now this is the model 1410 scanner base antenna. I see some things online about this. I figured since I uh, picked up another one, I'd just kind of do an overview of the antenna in case anybody would want to see this in detail before getting one. So we have our coral slash base, as they call it. And this is where your top radials go and your bottom ones. Then we have our connector here. And if we want to throw an overall measurement of that, around three and three quarter inches. And our top radials are 11 and a quarter inches long. And the bottom ones are 32 and three quarter. And as you can see, each one of these have a little uh, nut that is uh, screwed on. And you'll just put these on the whole way on all of them. Comes with a little Allen wrench for the set screws here. You have two of those. Now, if you take a piece of one inch PVC pipe, the white stuff, and put it in there, that fits really good if you'd want to use something like that, especially inside your attic or whatnot. Might work out really well in an easy way to do it. Now, I already have one of these up in the attic, and what I have done is take a piece of, like, a white string or any type of string, and I just ran it through a couple radials and just hung it off of a uh, screw in the attic. And as you can see, when you screw them in there, you have a little... Uh, that nut so I'm just going to just lightly tighten that on there so the radial don't back out over time especially if it's outside dealing with the wind and all that so I'll uh, put these together and I'll be right back all right, so we have all of them in but one. And all, like I said, all you gotta do is just screw that in. Then we'll just tighten it just slightly. But anyway, there's the top radio. Now if we throw a measurement from side to side, you're looking at pretty much 23 inches. Uh, your bottom radial is obviously a lot bigger. And what I'll do is just try to get you an overall measurement. I've seen that online. Some people want to know what the overall is. So we have it in there. And each one of them has a little rubber boot on and if we just kind of place it on the floor, make it level, you're looking around, you're looking around 30 inches tall once it's, once everything is put together when it's setting on the floor. So that'll give you a kind of an idea of what it would look like from here to the bottom of the radio. When they're all installed, standing up, just sitting on the floor, around 30 inches tall overall. So, hopefully that kind of helps out. I'll throw a link in the description to this antenna. And uh, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for another one.